This would make a great case for art supplies, right? It has all these little compartments. And so I thought, well, let's give it a try and see uh, how this works out. So I think it would be perfect. And then on the front, there's even a little pocket here. So let's see how this looks when we add all of our art supplies to it. Wow, I sure crammed a lot of stuff into this tech pouch. Probably more than I should have, but I really wanted to experiment with it and see how much I could get in here. So on this side, I have a little coffee uh, chocolate tin. I got this in Belgium. And inside, I just have some little bits of paper. I could certainly put these in a little envelope and save space. A little a stack of watercolor cards to work and paint on, a binder clip for my journal, scissors, could definitely use a smaller pair. This is a little watercolor plate where I can do some mixing if I want. This is completely optional because my watercolor tin already has a mixer on it. Watercolor pencils, paint brushes, And in here, I have three rolls of washi. And then on this side, I was able to get four small tubes of acrylic paint and some pens. And then up here, a glue stick pencil sharpener, a water brush, watercolor palette, and my journal. So there you go. All of these things were crammed into my tech pouch. So what a great way to create a travel and go, just a quick pack it all up um, with all these little compartments in it. I just happened to have this because I was using it for my tech and I thought, hmm, I hope this little tip on transforming your tech pouch into an art supply on the go uh, travel pouch um, you found helpful. All right, thanks for watching.